my name's Joss Taylor um, and I am a project manager for Bow Arts Trust. Um, we've been running for just shy of 25 years, our 25th anniversary next summer. Uh, we were set up by uh, Marcel Batig um, back in East London. We now operate 16 sites uh, around London, uh, both housing and studio sites. Uh, and I look after mainly the enterprise element within that, um, so linking in our studio sites uh, with the local community, uh, running arts checks projects and supporting the artists that we have within our sites. So fundamentally the aim of Bow Arts Trust is to support um, artists and creative businesses um, by providing affordable workspace. Um, we then take, uh, so each building will have a surplus and we reinvest that money into our award winning uh, education programme. So we work with 100 schools uh, yearly. Um, we pay artists to deliver these workshops, so it's an ecosystem within the arts buildings that then fund arts education, hopefully uh, showing the next generation that they can do it as a career, not a hobby. Um, yeah, that's the kind of fundamental aim. Our first main problem is finding space to operate from. Um, rents are going up and up, we're getting further and further out, so we have to be quite uh, Inventive with how we uh, find space, it's not like we can go and find a huge 20,000 square foot uh, workspace or warehouse anymore. So we have to partner with people, work with local authorities, um, working with the community. Um, a lot of our projects are founded on the belief that the community want us there. Um, so I think that's fundamentally our main problem, is space within London. We're getting further and further out and artists are having to go further and further out of London. They can't stay in London anymore. So we have to keep the rents as affordable as possible to keep them creating in London. Otherwise, they're all going to leave and go to Berlin or wherever. So the building we sat in, uh, the Lakeside Centre, uh, still sort of feels like the future to me a bit. We've been working on this project for three, four years uh, and we've just opened its phase one. So we have 40 artists here, we have 40 artists living in the borough now um, and we're just starting to work on phase two which will uh, include a training kitchen and cafe um, which should be launching any minute now.